Bullock and I'm about to attend a black barbecue for the first time. I've never been to a black barbecue before. I've never been invited to a black barbecue, but I'm happy to go. I have no idea what to expect at a black barbecue. Fried chicken. Main things I find at a black barbecue, black people. Everything black at a black barbecue, that's what you find. Niggas don't have vegetables. Vegetables are chips. So a nigga bag of chips is a vegetable. White folks have salads, they have kale salads, they're grilling vegetables, they're grilling salmon on a wood plank, you know what I mean? They're laughing, you know, they're tossing strawberries in each other's mouths, you know what I mean? They're petting dolphins, they're riding horses, you know. Why does that look like that? This is ribs right here, this is pork spare ribs right here. You're gonna use the uh, Tony Saturies, you got the famous Dave rib rub, you got black pepper, you got some lemon pepper right there. And you just kind of season it up both sides. And then you got the barbecue sauce right here. Uh -huh. And once they get done on one side, you hit it with the barbecue sauce, flip it, hit it with the barbecue sauce again. White people are known for not putting enough seasoning on stuff. One time I ate some white potato salad, it was like eating air. Or they have seasoning, but it ain't shit really. You know, like they'll put rosemary on a big ass chicken, just rub it with rosemary. And it was like, oh, that's gonna. And once the flav gets in there, what flav? It's just a leaf. You rub it on this big ass piece of chicken. The mama pointed at salt and she said, what is that, cocaine? I said, no, bitch, that's salt. What is that? That's a hot lake. Hot lake? What's in it? It's like a bunch of stuff, like the pig, like a bunch of pig parts. Like a sausage. Like a sausage. Yeah, like, a sausage. like a sausage. When the pig is happier, it comes out as a hot lake. When yeah. it's depressed, it's a hot dog. Yeah. I'll yeah. pass on that. Steve, let me tell you <laughs> After you eat this barbecue, yeah. the first thing we want to do is get you a new pair of jeans, man. I ain't never seen a man wear mom jeans. Can we get your new pair of jeans? Yeah, he just bought get, those jeans. They not that bad, Steve. Just untuck them. Just, just, yeah. look, just untuck yeah, your yeah, shirt. Yeah. Come on, Steve. We, we untuck your shirt. There you go. Yeah. Come on. Untuck it. Loosen up here. Loosen up. Hey, Steve. Yeah. Triple OG Steve. What kind of games y'all play, man, when you, um, have barbecues and stuff. I don't do stuff outside. Yeah, I don't know. You don't, don't do know. stuff you, outside. You're you not going to picnics? Yeah, we just, uh, I, I got to keep them from like running into the lakes and like drowning running them. Running into the lakes and drowning <laughs> themselves? Where are y'all rich? Where's the lake at? I ain't never been to no damn lake. <laughs> grandma, what do you think, Grandma? Delicious. There you go. Why do you like barbecuing instead of just cooking it inside and being inside? I mean, just to be outside and enjoy nature, mm -hmm. enjoy this freedom. Because if you ever been inside, you're gonna be, you're gonna love being outside as much as possible. Yeah, they don't barbecue in jail a lot. No. So, yeah. Actually, they never barbecue in jail. Yeah. No. Yeah. So how often do you barbecue? On the average, we barbecue like at least twice a month because somebody's getting out of prison. Yeah. Or somebody got a job promotion. Like big or somebody just came up on some meat. I don't yeah, know, homie yeah, had a deal, like a truck fell over, and Real he time. just was like, we finna mm -hmm. barbecue for the next two weeks straight. Yeah. Actually, there was gonna be some grilled salmon, mm -hmm. but what happened was Teddy took the money for that and bought weed with it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Let's play dominoes, man? Okay, yeah. Let's play some dominoes, yeah, man. Yeah, show me how to play. All right, Steve. This is a gladiator sport you're about to take part in. This is dominoes. And around these parts, we take our dominoes very, very, Seriously. Now, this is not for the faint of heart. You gotta have tough skin, because I'm gonna say a lot of shit about your mama. I'm gonna tell you, you ain't shit. You ain't gonna win. And victory is, is mine. You know what I'm saying? Your defeat is imminent. You understand that, right? Yeah. I'm the king of this table, Steve. We'll see. Damn. He already on the right track. He already on the right track. You see, you see what happened? He on the right track. After that rib, he nigga up. Okay. He on the right track. I didn't want to be the one to say it. It's a hot lake. The hot lake, nigga them up. Okay. This is called washing the dishes. When you mix the domino, okay? You mix them up real good. And right now is when the crash talking really actually begins. And if and if you domino with 15, you jump up and grab your nuts. You like domino. No, okay, Steve. Man. Steve. No, Steve. Steve. No, Steve. Slam it down oh, like from the back. Like you yeah. Yeah. That is not like Steve to talk smack. No. Steve has been around the, this earth for a little bit. You know what I'm saying? He's not like young and dumb. Like he's heard some sh slick shit being said over his life. So when he was like, "No, you won't," like that's that's mainly his response. No, you will not. Five down. I got that, like we all over there, I'm fucking that bitch tonight. We slapping dominoes and he's like, that was solid. <laughs>